Hi, I'm Sonia Kelly. Hello, I'm Nelly Yusipova. Nelly, together we've been doing work on uh, Ukrainian women refugees and looking at their journeys. And one thing we're tracking is how much cash they're carrying outside of the formal financial system and the risks that they face as a result. I wonder if you can tell us a story of a woman who has had to use cash in her journey and, um, and some of the risks that she faced. I want to tell you a story about Nadia, 65 years old nurse practitioner from Mariupol. She was living in Mariupol together with her mother, 90 years old woman who died at the beginning of the war. And Nadia for a while was hiding in a shelter in Mariupol until the moment when she was able to escape to Moldova. And Nadia was literally carrying an envelope with cash, uh, which was like all her, her mother life saving because she was carrying it because she did not have a chance to put it to a bank. And also second reason why she had cash because she was not sure that she will be able to easily pull money from her Ukrainian bank account when she arrives to Moldova. And unfortunately, um, all her money was stolen, the whole envelope. And uh, now this woman has to work at low paid job and make very little money, but she needs to survive. So um, she told us that from now on, she has enough cash only to buy bread and to color her hair. 